about cat what is everywhere? up what is up everybody it's the brew breath podcast and episode ep- 50 episode 50 finally passed from the 40s it's been a while it's been every, a while every, every time we do this has been a while now it is i mean like but it happens if happens. we skip two weeks life happens yeah but i think it's I, better this way i think it makes it juicier now like yeah you know yeah so like as a, as a so so you 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 be eating around this, don't you be? No. Oh. Um, feel like I'm gonna find like chips and stuff like. No, know? bro. I I don't eat actually. It's just the I'm gonna wipe I it down. I don't eat actually. I don't. <laughs> I, that's that's how you. That's how you know somebody's a liar. Like, yeah, did you eat around? Bro, I don't nah, even eat. Like, I don't eat around like 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 like, like when they when they ask like the uh, Prince Henry or whatever. Like, did you sleep with a sixty? He's like, I don't even, I don't even sweat. Sleep. I don't like, sweat. Even, yeah, they were like, oh, she said you were profusely sweating. I wasn't And he was like, I don't sweat. I have a rare condition. I don't sweat at all. Like, it done never happens. Like, I don't sweat shit. Nah, I put, I always put the laptop away from me when I eat, like, at least an arm's length. Oh, okay. Well, not my arm's length, because that should be far and far away. Like, your arm's length. Wow. <laughs> nah, so, so, as we were saying, like, yeah, like, my dad's, my dad's coworker, uh, like, one of them, like, it recognized us from like the hint, like the, from the photos and everything, yeah. and uh, and I I think like yeah that was his way of like trying to trying to like fuck with it and shit. Yeah, yeah. What was I saying right before that? What was we talking about right before that? All right, so we can't figure it out. Get into the wait, m- wait. Were you nah, talking nah, nah. about like not jerking off to like oh, get to the oh, other oh, side? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But we'll go back into oh, okay. it later. Okay, like start okay. off with this mayor stuff. So mayor's okay, age so got robbed, right? Like run that story. I thought Mayor Adams got robbed, but yeah, then when I say it like yeah, that, for, it's, the, for the clicks, for the clicks, yeah, I was like, yeah, hey, finally they booked them. Because if you put aid to mayor, nobody cares about the aid. Aid to mayor, just put aid's name, bro. Just put man got robbed. They're like yeah, they put Mayor Adams robbed, so it looks like Mayor Adams. All right, robbed. I'm gonna play the I'm gonna play that, the clip that, in Brooklyn, like aid. It almost sounds like you're sending aid to Mayor Adams. Because it says aid to Mayor Adams, you know? Like, it's like not aid for... And Dana, that aid to the mayor, 33-year-old Chris Bob, was walking down the street along Hudson Avenue. So, hey, yo, by the way, hold up. Isn't that, like, the most scammer name in the world? Like, yo, what's your name? Chris Bob. I think it's Chris Bald. Run it Bob. back. No, before that. Before right, like that, now, before that, they said his name before that. All right, all right. And Dana, that aide to the mayor, 33-year-old Chris Baum, was walking oh, down bomb. York Street along... Chris Hudson Baum. Hudson. What you the fuck? You sound worse fuck? even. Chris Baum. Why don't, you, why don't you, like, let this play and then look up who's the now, mayor's aide, like... confronted by two men. Now, police sources tell us those men demanded his personal belongings, including Cell phone. They eventually pushed him to the ground. Wait, hold up. Did you say phone you twice? Go wait. Go wait. Demanded his personal belongings, including his phone and cell phone. They eventually pushed what? him to the ground. Now, the Did they say his phone and his cell phone? <laughs> yo, 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 yo. Talk about trying to make the story long. You know, he used to write the book reports and try to just put a lot of extra words in there. I know you could put the same word again. Like you said, like, yo, in this, this study. Yeah. It's like, in yo, this wait. study. Da, da, da. Hey, did you find this mayor's, uh... It just says Chris now in the report. Why did you say... write Chris Bob or some shit like that? Like... I, I did. Oh. Nah, bro, it's not Chris Bob. His name is not Chris Bob. It's like Chris Bob. Not Mob. <laughs> oh, Bog. Bog. Christopher Bog. He's having a fun time. So, so basically, they Christopher de- Bog. Oh, this dude. Stop it. He was gonna get robbed anyway. <laughs> Stop it. Bro. And yo, they were like, yo, he said he's running back the story again. They said he was the maid's heir. No, don't rob me. I work for the mayor. By two men. Now, police sources tell us those men demanded his personal belongings, including his phone and cell phone. They eventually pushed him to the ground. Now, the aide told. 
Bro, I'm not gonna lie, it sounds like in a high school when they just, yo, give me your shit. You don't want to do it, man. That's no, they're I'm like, yo, bro. No, no, but it's like, they pushed him to the ground. Wow. And they took his but shit. Yo, what? It's his phone and his cell phone. I don't know what that means, but there's no... Maybe he had two phones, like work phone and... Yeah, but they would have said it. And cell it phone. actually pushed him to the ground. Now, the aide told those men, you don't want to do this. I work for the mayor. That's according to sources. That's when one of the men lifted his shirt, exposing a handgun. Then they ripped <laughs> his phone from his pocket along with his wallet. We're told the aide walked down the block to a police... So they took his phone, his cell phone, but he didn't say wallet then. Oh. He said wallet now. Yeah. My man's story is a little messed up over here. You I feel swear. me? They sent them too early out in the morning for this. Okay, bro. I feel like See, this what is I'm a setup. This is, like, is a yeah, setup, it's a bro. Setup. It's a setup. It I feel make... like it's a setup and... Why wouldn't, when you're getting robbed, right? When do you tell the guy, yo, you don't want to do this? You never Only say that. Only when you're going to shoot him back. Yeah. This dude is going to push him. Hey, you don't want to do this, bro. I work for the man. Die. Like, bro, come on, bro. Like, he's, you don't think he's like, he's, I feel like that's what they're making. And you get robbed. You get robbed. Like, you just give your shit and then you go. Right? Like, who's these? Like, when do you have... you? So, you're giving up all your shit, but you still got the cojones to be like, nah, bro, you don't want to do this. I work for the mayor. What does that have to do with anything? Nah, that's a setup, If bro. anything, the phone that got robbed was a phone that has some info on it that needed to disappear. That too? Yeah. You know, the aide's always going to hold all the work. Yeah, that's true. You know? Mayor's not going to get his hands dirty. That's true. That's very true. And then the phone just got robbed. Yeah. Crazy guns, right? Yeah. It just t- tossed that. And like the phone, but forget about what's on the phone. Like it went, it got robbed. Guns. So you Problem. Kill, you kill two birds with one stone because then you you hit the gun agenda thing and then you hit whatever's on my cell phone. Yeah. That's crazy. I didn't think about it like that. Yeah. You're right. Mm-hmm. All right. The dude didn't even pull out a gun on him. He pushed him to the ground and, and he showed said, him. No, but he said, you don't want to do this. I work for the mayor. Then he pulled out the gun. Like, bro, shut up. Mm-hmm. I don't even know if that story sounds real. It doesn't sound real. It sounds like... Sounds like you shut the fuck up when you're getting robbed. Like, yeah. Why would you talk... And what is this old school robbery of like, yo, he went like this. And he was like, I know. You know what I'm saying? Like, come yeah. on. But you already knew the deal before... Does it, yo, bro? They're pushing you to the floor. They could have a knife. It don't matter at this point. Right. The gun is not. Right. Like it's not. This is this. Yo, yo. And it's not even a. Their big... PR team sucks. Yeah. It is their like... PR team sucks. Cause first get of me all... on your team. I'll make you look good. Mayor Adams, bro. You, bro. We we'll get some makeup artists. Put some bruises on you and shit. Finesse, bro. Like. <laughs> Watch that be the next fucking thing. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Like, watch that. He's going like, to get set up. He'll be like, yo, I got punched in the face. I got and pistol like, whipped. Yeah, pistol. That's what we got to get gunned yeah, with yeah, off yeah. the street. They, gonna throw, they threw it like a slipper. Like, they just tossed a gun in my direction. <laughs> Caught me in the head in the meeting. I was like, yo. Really he's going to dodge it like George Bush and shit with the slipper in Iraq. He's just fucking, you know what I'm saying? Like, he's going to do that shit. Like, crazy. That's, that's just, I just don't yo, bro. I'd be very suspicious of that. And then on the nine one one thing, you wanted to get into that? Yeah. So it was um I saw a story of a nine one one operator who's facing a charge of involuntary manslaughter. Wait, hold up. Did you see the story about this old guy in the deli in Manhattan that got robbed uh by some black dude? It was like I think he told something to the to the girlfriend of the guy and then the guy just came in to rob him. So the old old dude in the deli mm-hmm. grabbed the knife and stabbed the guy. Now he's getting charged with murder. What? Twenty years, or something. But it's... I know they're gonna drop the charges. Yeah. But honestly, like real shit. Now that I say it out loud, I feel like they just did that for sensationalize, and eventually they're just gonna drop the charges to self defense. Because that was self defense. Like, like if you Google, if you YouTube this, there's a video. Old dude, bro, you would have thought he was like a Guyanese guy or some shit. 
Apparently it's a black guy, but I, I could be wrong. Somebody said it was a black guy. I saw the video on the blog. But guy getting a, a man charged with murder, uh, a deadly, deadly something. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, that guy. That was see the old guy with the striped yeah. shirt. He stabbed the guy and killed him. And. Who tried to rob him? Very younger, very younger than him, very bigger than him. It's not confronted. Yo, look how this media pay stop calling the dead, dead guy, guy a victim, bro. Yeah. Like, what the hell is wrong with these people? Yo, that ass, yo, like, burning hell. Look at this grimy old, dried yeah. up coochies. This guy. Are you kidding me? Simon pushed the clerk behind the bodega counter and then He deserves to die. He deserves that. Struggle. Fuck that. No, nah, bro. Stab him in the neck, bro. This gentleman was here. Uh Murphy provided for his family and you know someone came behind the counter. And what I viewed was inappropriate. You're stupid, bro. This is why your aide got robbed. You should get robbed. Like, I swear, like, Yo, bro, like, I crazy. swear, bro, this is so stupid. This is, this is how he looks out for the elderly. This is how the this mayor, is how he, this yeah, is how he looks yeah. out for the elderly. This is inappropriate. What are you talking about, bro? That girl, apparently there was a girl that told him to go in there and do this to the guy. Like, yo, you so stupid. You, you look so stupid, bro. You should, you should, you should, like, that guy should stand up for his own. Bro, his own race should be stomping yeah. his whole family out because, like, how you supposed to rep black people and then now you black and then you, like, doing violent... Like, if you're black, you rep black people, bro, period. Yeah. So, like, you beating up an old dude, that's wrong. Right. You look like a bum. Yeah. That's two thirty. You got the Amiri shirt on doing this. Like, you know what Facts, I'm saying? Like, what yeah. is... Like, you're so what? stupid, bro. Stop yeah. with the stereo... Bro, you're so stupid. You deserve to die on that one, bro. Yeah. I don't... Yo, bro, I swear to God, bro, like... I don't get it, bro. Why would you attack an old man and then you end up dead? How are you so pussy? You couldn't even beat up an old dude. And they calling him a victim and all. Let's run this. There's no confront for the suspect writing career criminals are let right out of jail without bail while a store clerk who apparently acted in self-defense is on Rikers Island. Facts. They sent him to Rikers. What I saw was a New Yorker who was doing his job and what and that disruption of the job happened because someone was aggressive. So I think he is on the clerk's side, to be honest. Yeah, aggressive. There's more because than aggressive. Was though, aggressive. That, they're trying to aggressive. downplay Aggressive. Yeah. Aggre you mean Assault? What are you talking about, bro? Yo, it's only... Yo, I don't even... Because somebody said this guy was black. I don't think this guy is black, right? No, he I think he might he be light-skinned. But I keep thinking he's like Guyanese or something. Brown, bro, this bro. guy is attacking him behind the counter. Behind the counter. Nah, that's ridiculous, He bro. deserved to die a thousand percent, bro. Yeah, nah, fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck that. And the girl that told him if there was a girl, I didn't even hear nothing about a no. girl or nothing. But if there was a girl that told him to go in there and do that, she should go to jail too. But they put this old guy in Rikers. Ridiculous. It's crazy, bro. This dude got like two months of his life left. You just made it even shorter because he already went through enough panic from that guy beating him up. Now they put him in jail. Mm. That's crazy. You man. know what? If that's I was there, crazy, I'd be bro. fucking happy I stabbed him in the neck at least. Fuck that. Yeah, that's crazy. There, like, it's better, either his life I, I or... I hope they've given him, like, hella respect in jail. Like, yeah. dude attacked you, you stabbed him, you killed him. Now you, like, hopefully he's Muslim and he just goes to the Muslim side where nobody really yeah. plays I mean, with he, nobody. he looks like he can blend in. He looks like he's Muslim. I don't yeah. know what's going on. I can't even, like, I, I don't even know what race the guy is. I, I don't know why somebody on the block told me that guy was black. But nah. uh, we all saw that video. He's like, I don't Oh, bro, like that, that don't look you know what I'm saying like convenience store, like, you know, like the name of the guy. 
What's the name of the guy that got uh that got assaulted? You think he said aggressive, aggressive, aggressive is how they robbed. Jose Alba. Aid. I think he's Hispanic. What? Jose Alba. Alba is Spanish. Hispanic? Could be. Yeah, look at him. Oh. He's Hispanic. Oh, he's Hispanic. He do look like... Yeah, here he we do. go back to the Indian looking like... Uh, like, mm. Bro, my man, man. Yeah, man. he's from DR, Dominican Republic. Bro, that nigga is lucky he didn't get Patria on these. That's he's crazy. wearing... He almost was wearing green, too. I think he's going to be fine, to be honest. I don't think he's going to... He should not be in yeah. jail. He should not be in lockup right now. He's not a danger to the society. Yeah. You don't know. Yeah, you don't know he would have killed him. Yeah, his daughter's just, bro, he acted in self-defense. Like, what do you... He's never been in trouble. He's never been locked up. We get it, man. That's crazy, bro. Next story. What we got here? We got gun laws and handing over social media information, right? So yes. if you want to get a gun, you got to hand over your social media information. Mm-hmm. I think that's pretty cool, but at the same time, it's pretty stupid cool part is that you could just kind of like I don't think it's pretty cool but I think it's alright you know I don't, I don't think I'm gonna like yeah but I was saying like you could just make a fake social media account and be like yeah this is my social media but it's not and you have like if you really wanted to hide your behavior or whatever because they're saying they want to see the character of the person blah yeah, blah yeah but blah. the thing is once they get your social media they know what other accounts you go on just through your phone so oh. if you can make the fake ones you would have to have a different phone you right. have to do a lot of different things because they could always just, they could always just be like, look, this is your IG, you're in this location, and then this other account is posting the gun from the same location. Uh, so we're gonna just say it's you, even if you have it on a different phone. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, yeah. but at the same time, it's like some of these dudes that you know, you can't be in New York like. You could buy a gun and then they, like show it off either. Like no, you're like, kinda, not supposed to do that though. I don't yeah, know. but at the same time, that I don't think they do. Do they do that anywhere else? What like thing? that that thing about like social media and stuff. I never heard of that. I don't know. Um, let's see. Yeah. So like, like I I don't understand like why they would want to do that because it's like, so you're just gonna have people paid. To like what? Like why do you want everybody's social media like that? Like can't you just like give me a follow yourself? Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, just give me a follow, bro. Like yeah. some shout outs. Like, help me out. You know, make it make it the deal suite. Like, how am I gonna give you money and then get a gun license and then you also take my IG down? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, stop it. No, it you only seems like it only, said, it only looks like New York. Yeah. That's it. That's what sucks, man. Yeah. That's New York. All right. So that doesn't make any sense. Why Why aren't you just catching the dudes that are illegally posting their guns on IG? I don't get that part. You know, like... I mean, I, I know they be catching them, them too. You know, like I, my boy told me a story about back in the day, like... What's up? I don't know. This was back in the day. Kid, kid showed a gun on Facebook and the next day the feds was at his crib, like... Oh, shit. Yeah, but that's not going to happen anymore, to be honest. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it does still happen. It just doesn't happen. Like, a lot of me also thinks, like, like let's say if you do some shit, like, in a nice area, like, Bayside and shit. Yeah. Like, do the gun thing, the feds are at your door. But now if you're in Bushwick and you're doing it, I think they let it rock. I they're think like, they let it rock. like, yo, let them kill somebody. Yeah. We'll wait on that one. Mm-hmm. We got to wait for... We don't have enough people. We don't have enough much of to do anything but get this gun back. But now if we get them on the charge of... Something, then yeah. we could really lock him away. Because what if we go knock him and then he ain't got the gun on him? There's not much we can do at that mm-hmm. point. Like, that would put us in jeopardy. Right. So that's another thing. Crazy times, bro, honestly. Yeah. All right, moving on. Okay, um, so we got Elon Musk pulling out of Twitter. Yeah, Elon Musk. So let me see what it says here. Elon Musk, I think, is pulling out of Twitter. I After a ever... dramatic few weeks of speculation let me finish. that his deal to take over the company was falling apart, um, he's you terminating can't... the merger agreement because Twitter is in material breach of multiple provisions of that agreement. Oh, so basically Twitter wasn't holding up with their end of the contract. So they made they made arrangements. They made a deal on certain things, but Twitter is not... 
doing it, I guess. But according. Elon is always known to like boost his stock and all that shit through Twitter and like talk shit to not back not back it up with anything. Yeah, you know, all of that like Elon's go- going on a on a thing of like saying but a now, lot of stuff but not doing it. Musk will have to prove that. To- so now they're saying you got to prove that Twitter breached the original agreement or you're being sued for a billion breakup fee. Uh, I think it's. I think it's just chitter chatter. If they drop that billion down to a million, I think he'll be fine. Let's see. Um, like if they drop that billion down to a million dollar, that would be fine because that's like it's fine. He can handle a million dollar loss. Uh, to Jessica, Musletter, Kasik. Uh, I think that must, yeah. To be honest, I didn't think that shit was gonna last long. I just had a feeling, like, yeah, this shit's gonna, like, I don't know, I didn't think it was gonna pull out. But now I just, like, I get it. Like, a lot of Elon shit is like, he puts, like, smoke and mirrors in front of you and Mm -hmm. shit. He's like, yo, I'm gonna do all of this shit, but then, like, never really follow up with a lot of shit. Like, a lot of, like, it's just all about the stock. Getting yeah. riled up mm-hmm. because of his antics on social media. I yeah. Think. Like, I don't know if has any much of bases and shit like that. It's crazy. Yeah. All right. So, that's that. All right. What we got? So, I, I wrote I wrote that, uh, that, uh, that, that these girls are getting very ballsy nowadays. Where, like, they really are. Bro, they really are, bro. Like now, is this like a new thing where girls like do this stuff, or this has been around though? I might be bugging. That's why. So, what he's referring to is how girls now will hit on you more than before. In my opinion, I think it's more of a now thing. Like I, I have seen it in the past, but not to this extent. Like now, the girls are like real masculine with it, like real in your face with it, like. You know, like, they still do the girl thing. Like, they'll drop hints, but they'll go out of their way now to get your attention. I, whereas before, it's like, you would have to do the cat and mouse game. Yeah. Now, like, now they do the cat and mouse game. I think I think it's because, like, a little bit of attention used to go a far way before. Yeah. Now, it's like, you, like, man, I don't know. You know what it is? Because a, a lot of it is also just being normal human being. That too. Right? Like, a lot of it is just, like, normal human... Like, are people being more open now? Is that what it is, too? Like, it's like... Before, the the girl that that liked you would probably be super mean to you or be the last one to ever talk to you. Right. That's true. And now they're just being up front. Yeah. That's true, too. I didn't think about it that way. That could be a possibility. I wonder if it's... (laughs) Ha! I just thought about some shit. Now listen to this one. Like, what if it's like they're really into this? Like, there's only a few high value males out there, and we need to grab these high value males before they run out. Like, I just I wonder if girls are thinking like that now. They're like, well, we we gotta be upfront now because we gotta make this deal happen. Yeah, I think so too because now it's pretty, it's pretty clear that there's not a lot of high marketable men out there. And obviously, those who are high caliber are going to have their own set of standards. The girls ain't really like that either, though, out there, you know? That's true. But it's just like, what if what if that's what girls are doing now? It's just yeah, like, they're, they're like, like more like snatch hunting. Me, yeah, they're just hunting snatch now. me up a husband. Yeah. yeah, but then they want that husband to have this, that, and this, that, and the third. And yeah, 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 has to act a certain way. I'm like, you're trying to like, build a husband. Like, you're not trying to actually meet a person. I hear your door just going. It's probably the wind. I think Bob or somebody laid down on it. Oh, okay. You want to go check up on it? Okay. All right, yeah, just to be sure. But yeah, man, the thing is that it might be it might be to a point where the girls are feeling like a lot more of these hoochies are just taking up all the dudes. I don't know. Do I don't even know? Do girls feel like they're in competition with hoes in general? Uh, like just in general, of, like know. spoiling do. Do girls think like that other whole girls go around spoiling dudes or like what's what's like the thought thought idea behind there? Like, do girls ever really think about majority guys and what the state of guys are 
at all? I don't know. I feel like I need to call up a couple of females to ask because I don't know. You want to call somebody? I don't know who I would call that would answer this question. The only person I could think of is Alex, but she's probably not going to pick up. Well, he's his sister. No, it's her birthday today. She's probably out already. But, all right. Ah, man, I know water. Pass me some of your water. You already got two drinks. I'm hungry, bro. I know. I'm feeling it. I got to go eat something. I'm feeling it, Mr. Krabs. But, yeah, listen. um, Anyways. All right. Uh, yo, 4th of <laughs> July was crazy, son. Yeah, like, it was fucking, crazy. Um, people got shot on 4th of July. So what shot. ended up happening in your blog? I know you told me. You told me like three oh, people different got people. Shot. People got shot. People got shot. It was crazy. Uh, your blog is too hot, I don't bro. even know. I don't even... Uh, I'm going to shoot something. No, 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 no. Don't even. Don't even. I don't want to know where you know my block is or anything. Oh, okay, okay, okay. okay. Uh, I, yeah, that's why I, once I started talking about it, I was like, I don't know where I can... Uh, yeah. So, uh, never mind. Yeah, so... It's Eid. Today, Eid. Yeah, I don't... I, how'd I forget? It's Eid. And Eid is... We have two Eids. As I said, uh, one Eid is... Uh, Basically, like the end of Ramadan, mm-hmm. and then the other Eid is after Hajj. Okay. So after Hajj ends, they do a Eid. Okay. And Hajj just ended. Hajj is the religious uh, journey uh, Muslims take to the Holy Land. Oh. Okay. Uh, once in a lifetime type shit. Okay. And uh, Hajj happens once a year. Um, the rest of the year it's. It's like Umrah. I think you're listening to the ice fall down from the freeway. No, that was a different sound from what I heard. Oh. Yeah. But yeah, so it's Eid. And then this one, usually in Pakistan, we... Um, we why don't you look up like Eid celebration in Karachi? Let's see what's going on over there. But in over there, like... It, and also, yo, so for Eid, over here... And, and just in general, for this Eid, we have to buy goats and cows or stuff, like mm-hmm. some type of animal like that, and slaughter it and eat it. Mm-hmm. But can you also Google, like, how much does it cost to buy a cow in New York? One fifteen. Oh, 2000 to two. Whoa. Yo, believe it or not, cows are cheaper in America than in Pakistan. Really? Look up, look up how much is a cow in Pakistan. Oh, yeah. Kurbani time is the crazy part, too. Like. One million? Uh, Rupees? So one million. Uh no, just copy the heaviest number and All then right. uh, that. yeah, that do uh that PKR, Pakistani rupees. That number, PKR to USD. To USD. Well, this is not even. This is a million. Yeah, but so where the you gotta fuck? see it. Uh, put that number in there. Uh, Just paste it. It's not letting me paste uh, it. Do you remember what it was? I think it was this. 5,000. That's still pretty cheap, though. Like, I Well, mean, and here it's 1,000 to 1,000. Uh, how, how much is a cow in Pakistan? For Qurbani. Uh, code is 200. I mean, yo, if this is the what the real rate is, I mean, that's not that bad. Somebody told me that it was in the thousands of dollars. Like, I ain't even gonna lie. Somebody saw, some, some cows, apparently, somebody said it can go up to like $10,000. I guess it depends on the breeds and shit. Oh, 100 grand to 250, but that's... 250,000? Two hundred and fifty thousand. We're probably looking at like two thousand five hundred dollars, but that's not that bad though. Mm-hmm. 
That's lit. That's not that bad. I thought it was. I don't know. I looked it up like a long time ago. I thought it was something like ten thousand or something. All right, whatever, bro. I don't know what's going on, but they be jacking up the prices around this that's time a lot too. too yeah, bro. so. I don't know. I don't know if that's like the Google result because I'm not gonna lie. I've asked around to a lot of people. They've said this in the five thousands for a goat. You get what I'm saying? So wow. I don't know if these numbers are legitimate over here. Like I mean, yeah, based off the Google search, like in the middle of the holiday, it's definitely gonna be more expensive. Probably double or triple the price. So that yeah, five thousand could turn and into then, like and then, you know, 15, like again, 000. like it could easily probably be like a lot better representation was. What what you saw? What was it like? It was like a hundred sixty five per per kilowatt or something of the weight. Like not because it was slash something. It was. I didn't. I don't remember. It was like. Uh, shit, hold on. <laughs> I was like, "What is that?" Yeah, yeah, nah, all right, yo, go out. Yeah, right there. One hundred and fifteen CWT. Right. Open a different tab and then write what is uh what is uh a uh, oh, what is a good. An adult cow's weight. Like. Carat total weight. Yeah. Carrot, nigga. Carat? <laughs> Yo, girl, diamonds ain't really all girls' best friends, are they? 1,400 pounds. 1,400 pounds. Uh, I mean, you got to put it on in, in the C carrot. Carrot watch. CWT, bro. <sighs> How not yeah? How, what is the to, what is a cow total weight? What is it? Are you looking this up from Pakistan? Bro, I are can't you a function fop? right now? Function to the best ability. This is not what I pay you for. <laughs> you don't pay me. This is not what I. This is exactly why I don't pay you because this is what you do. All right. So what am I looking up? Bro, we trying to weigh out cows like. But I, I just told you fourteen hundred. Yeah, but I don't know what that is in the kilowatts and shit like. Okay. From that shit like fourteen hundred to kilowatts. Took put that. Uh, not kilowatts. Whatever. C W C T W. Is it a C W T? I'll go back. Well, because of the fact that. C W T. So it's one fifteen times fourteen hundred, wouldn't it? No, cause what, what CWT was carrot. Okay, so how how many pounds is one CWT? How many pounds is one CWT? One hundred twelve. Oh, so uh, it's a hundred and twelve. <sighs> Uh, pound and how heavy is a cow? The average is fourteen hundred. Fourteen hundred. So so if you have four, so well, come on, so you went to college, like, come on, so you got this. What what's the math we doing over here? So if it's like fourteen hundred pounds mm -hmm. and one is a hundred pounds, a hundred, so it'd be like ten ten times the amount almost. It'd be ten times the amount. So it'd be. If we go up, so if it's, if, what was it? It was $115 per CWT? Yeah. Right? Mm-hmm. Uh, so 100, so it'd be, it'd be 10 times that. Okay. So like, yeah, that still comes out to like 1500 or something like that. So if the CWT for a cow is about one third of it, you'll pay around 750 for a 500 pound calf. It's a cow. 500 yeah. pound. A full-grown beef cow can cost up to five thousand. We still probably lowballing that number. Mm-hmm. Like people really be raising the prices because how many like they be really limiting the supply and shit like that. You controlling that shit, but all right, you know what? That's Eid. Happy Eid, everybody. This person's really hungry over here, and I'm getting hungry watching this person be more hungry. Anything else you want to say? Nah, it's 35 minutes in. We're good for now. We'll be back next week, hopefully. Hopefully. All right, mm -hmm. thank you for tuning in with us. It's been the Brew Breath Podcast. Like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, episode 50, and we'll get to you next time, and we're wow. out.